Wild Eyed Northern Boy. Uh, today is Friday, um, yeah, Friday the 20th. Okay, before we get started, I'm assuming, okay, there's a gold side. We're just gonna, here's a red wire, here's a yellow wire, okay. Then there, here's a ground wire, okay. I didn't break the tab yet. Okay. Oh, you want to go into this panel box? I don't want to. Okay. So, before we forget, or me forget, okay, just say we got a red wire, yellow wire. Okay. This is not an emergency either. This is just something I need to get done. Okay. Right back to where we started from. The center one is black, the, the white, the center one is black, and the center one is white. And it runs to my motor. Okay. Now, I know for a fact, see that copper ground wire right there? It's a ground. It's ground out to, not that screw, but there's another screw. Um, down in there. I know it's grounded. So I know this is wire is grounded. And I know the wire is grounded in the box. Okay. I understand, Greg Porter, that you're saying to hook up the uh, one yellow wire, just say the yellow wire to the white wire, and the red wire to the black wire. And I'm assuming. I'm going to take this ground and you want me to ground it in here. Well, this is all drywalled and I don't want to be digging through that wall. So I'm assuming if I know that compressor is grounded, which I wired it, I'm not an electrician, so I should be able to ground off that box. I'm still nervous as a whore in church how to do it. You know what's weird is that that plug right there is 220 for the plasma cutter okay and the compressor is 220 and I wired that and I wired all these fluorescents I wired everything it just kinda when I'm going down to 220 down to 110 I'm still kinda confused anyway let's move on with um, the festivities you ready let's do it people <laughs> Just got my last back, I got the feeling in my face is screaming. 
get, 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 get. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, 10 11 the guy. Sorry you didn't make the cut. I already give you two choices, two chances, but you want to be a piece of samba anyway. <clears throat> um, I just felt that if I put this up on the wall, it'd be here for ever and a day. Um, if I wore the shirt, um, I would trash it out. So I just thought I would put it in a picture frame and preserve it. That's just me. Um, I don't know who did the artwork on this. I just, um, everybody knows me. I have to just kind of, um, add my own little something to it. That's all. Anyway, um, where do we start? Okay. Uh, Pat Man last week brought some trim around the window over. Check out this, people. Really? I don't know who did this. Let me turn some light on for you. There we go. We're going to talk about some DA scratches. Let me see it'll pick up. Oh, yeah. Isn't that lovely? Ooh. Mm. Let's get a closer look at this rascal. They even left some old tape on for me. Somebody, um, really? Don't get me wrong. I've hit trim before. But I just don't keep on going. Um, I think they're like 360 scratches. Yeah. Um, I used to take the trim off. But if you don't take the trim off, you know, um, let's put some duct tape on it. If you don't want to spend duct tape, put three layers of masking tape on it. But I used to put duct tape on it because, you know, wow. Because I, um, that ain't going to make the paint job look any better. But hey, it's all good. Uh, what else I got to talk about today? Oh, you want to see my version of the sun gun? No, it's not 3M's $300, $400 sun gun. Don't get me wrong, I'd like to have one. Don't have to have one, but I've been light on paint more than once. Um, yeah. Um, maybe my eyes are bad. I don't know. So you can tell what uh, year this was made in. Had it been like in the 70s, man. Had to man with that um, hairdo kind of thing. I don't think this thing's ever been used. You know, the tags are still on it. Yeah, it's a Sabania. Um, yeah. You want to see how bright this thing is? I don't know if it's even going to work, but um, we kill the lights for a minute. This thing is like, um, really? Okay. You ready? Yeah, that's how bright that thing is. I'll show you how bright it is. It's unreal. Wow. Better burn your eyeballs and it gets hot too. Come on now. Stand up for a minute. There you go. Makes you get little spots. Okay, you ready? Yeah, it's pretty bright. Um. Okay. Uh, like I said, you get heat off it. Um, is it gonna work? I don't know. My eyes are still. Um, I think so. I would say it's a poor man's version of um, sun gun. Like I said, you get some heat off it. Make it go blind. Anyway, that kind of crapped me up because I envisioned this and um. Some um, old lady's closet somewhere because they, you know, old ladies keep all the little directions and stuff. I ain't never seen a Ziploc bag this big, but anyway, what else I got to talk about? Um, yeah, the compressor, and then now I got to do this. Um, yeah, I got to block this out. Um, yeah, thought I had something else to say. Apparently, I ain't got Jack to say. Um, we go and show you the festivities. Okay, how many minutes I got going on? I thought there was something else. Oh, maybe you guys can help me with this thing too. I don't get this. I rebuilt it. I know how to rebuild a 2001 gun. 
but I surely don't know how to rebuild this. Where is it at? I'll even show you what it does. That model 62 Binks. Yeah, um, I don't know what the heck. It's a little bit different, like I said, than the 2001 Binks. And I thought I could rebuild it, but um, come on, don't jerk with me. This is what it does. Oh, fuck, I ain't even got a tip on it. Um, all it does is blow air out. Um, even before I pull the trigger. Okay. Let's go on and put that back. Fuck it. Yesterday wasn't very productive. I hit a... Here we go. You ready? I locked the gate today. Man, I don't want no uh, visitors be roaming in my yard. Um, when people... When people... How do I say it? Not all people. <clears throat> spit it out, shoe. Just spit it fucking out. Don't candy coat it. Tell like it is. Okay. Let me turn some electricity off in this villa. Okay. Yeah. Oh, we got these two guys. Come on now. Damn camera. Camcorder, whatever it is. Commercial break. these two guys, I don't know, the Boat Brothers, whatever, they had me quote their cars a few different times. One is named Brandon, I think, I don't know, my wife would remember the name. I didn't remember it. Wow, actually, this is just going to be excellent. Okay, I don't know, Brandon got something, I don't know. Color Supreme, don't they all got Color Supremes? Anyway, he wanted the door jams painted and underneath the hood and all this stuff and he got some rust not a lot of rust but he got some rust and he got like nine dents in the goddamn hood okay um I quoted four grand 2013 might not even be alive then but anyway then his brother he got something I can't remember I seen I remember he got one dent and pesticide fender but he ain't got a rust on it it's pretty clean and I ain't got to spray no door jams no trunk lid none of that stuff but, uh so it's work <clears throat> anyway, I called them 2000, which is kind of low. I knew that from the get go, but I figured, fuck it. Um, that's like eight months away. I may mean, shake his hand, so I ain't got to stick to it. But anyway, Boat was over here yesterday for fucking three hours and 16 goddamn fucking minutes. Really? Really? Anyway, you got to be nice to him, kind of, but fucking get out of control. Anyway, um, Brandon be fucking kind of saying, uh, why is his brother so much cheaper? And I said, because I ain't got to do no door jams and all this stuff. They still buy their own base and clear. Fuck it. Anyway, parental guidance. Um, and then he said, and then he says, I said, you want me to just pack the you know, rust holes with some marglass or bond or whatever? I don't care, man. I said, you got all them dents in the hood? And then um, he says something. I said, well, you need a um, stud gun to pull it out, pull the dents out, and hammer it, whatever. I said, it's a lot of labor. That's what he's saying. I already know where he's going. Stupid ass. He says, um, I need to let him borrow my stud gun. I just ignored it. Whatever, man. Basically, what he's saying is, he wants to borrow my stud gun, which I don't let my motherfucking tools out no more. Uh-uh, ain't never gonna fucking happen because they don't never come back the way they're supposed to be. Trust me on that one. Fuck that. You need a tool, go buy your own damn tools. You ain't getting mine because they don't never fucking come back the way they fuck supposed to. Trust me on that one. Anyway, that's my fucking pet peeve. I had to buy my own tools anyway so basically what he want to do is pull out his own dents which he don't know how to fucking do it anyway and then so he can get a cheap price you know what I don't think either one of them get the goddamn car painted in this motherfucking garage I don't think so because he's kind of irritated me now he want to borrow my motherfucking tools so he can do some work in the fucking driveway or something. Next he want to borrow some fucking bondo. It's like a neighbor borrowing sugar and apples and fucking eggs and sausage and everything. Why don't you just cook the motherfucking breakfast for you too? Why don't they just go and get their own fucking garage? Get their own compressor and all this shit? Man, I already know where he's going. I already know where he's going. It's like, you know what? Stupid asses. It's kind of like this. You want to negotiate with the painter and body, man. Beautiful. But I don't negotiate. 
This just ain't no negotiation. It's like negotiating with a fucking tattoo man. Really? You want to lower the price? You think it's going to get quality tattoo on your motherfucking skin? Really? People ain't, people ain't want the fucking program. And the one for 2000 That's too low. I already know that. Fuck it. Why did I say that? I don't know. Maybe I was in a good goddamn mood at the fucking time. But I already know it's going to be like this. That's eight months away. Cost of living done went up. Electricity went up. Like my old man would say, price of pussy done fucking went up. So everything went up. Groceries? And like, I'm going to stick to that 2000 Really? Hell no. Kind of like this. Why don't you do a spray out? I haven't done a spray out yet. And this dude come down here. Why well, know when you didn't done Pat Man spray out yet? No, I ain't done it. He asked me like three times. Motherfucker, what? Who the fuck are you? You visiting? This is my fucking this is my garage. Anyway, you know, so you do, I haven't done a spray out. Because uh what? I'm supposed to where's the clear at? I'm supposed to pull that on, on mine? Hell, nah, stop! Ah! Hold the train here. No. You know what? Fuck, enough is enough. Anyway, I wanted to prime me a hoodie. I'm getting out of control. Hey, this is the way it is. I'm Friday. Um, I wanted to prime that hoodie to get in that trunk. But, you know, in Michigan, it fucking rains all the goddamn time. Look at the humidity. Yeah, right up in 90. Mm -mm. Oh, look at them temperatures. Oh, ain't that fucking beautiful? Mm hmm. So, that's why I haven't done a spray out. Um, that's why I didn't spray no primer. But it's kind of like this. That's why I, that's why I locked them up again. I ain't lying shit. Fuck that noise. So, uh, fuck it. If they can see me, I don't care. They're going right there. See that fail lock? That's right. She locked. You know what? You can come and visit me for three hours and 16 motherfucking minutes and your car ain't getting painted until fucking eight months from now? Like I said, I might be fucking dead. And then want to piss them on and borrow my tools so you can fix your shit to get a cheap price? Hell no. Go on and get your car painted from somewhere else. I don't mean to bitch, but man, fuck all this noise. Really? Motherfucking tools cost money. Electricity costs money. We ain't special fucking friends. I don't even know him. I just quoted his car. Now we now I act like we fucking date or some bullshit. I don't hate people, but goddamn, I would never ask if somebody's gonna pay my motherfucking car. If I didn't like the price, I didn't fucking don't say nothing. Fuck it, just move on. But I would not ask to borrow the man's tools so I can work on my own car and so I can save a buck. Really? Yeah, that, yeah, that, that's gonna work. Really? <laughs> some people stupid. Anyway, how many minutes did I burn? 18 minutes. Oh, God, we got to cut this short. Peace of mind. Peace of oneself. Peace of property. Peace of pussy. Peace of pizza. Peace on earth. Rest in peace. Peace of the pie. Bigger piece of the puzzle. Bigger piece of the motherfucker ass. Give me some motherfucking money, please. And uh, when the big dogs get all done eating, they don't lend their motherfucking tools out. Eating pubs get a piece of something, motherfucker. Please. Gonna run my tools off. Mm -mm. Been down that motherfucking road before. They don't never bring your motherfucking tools back right. They don't. Why? I don't know. I don't know why people don't take care of the fucking something else's tools. I don't buy no, nobody's shit. Some people, you know, it's like they take my, uh, my kindness, yeah, sometimes I'm kind. My kindness for weakness. You know what? Get the fuck up out of here. There's only two motherfucking reasons you're here. Because you think I'm good, which I'm okay, and I know I'm cheaping everybody, and then you just want to fucking borrow tools too? Really? Yeah, okay. And I told my wife I didn't want to lock that gate because then they'll just ring the door, but you know what my wife said? When she's here on the weekend, she said she just ignore it. She's like that. She don't give a fuck. She'll tell people when she be out in the front yard walking, and people be walking up, say, ask them about me. He said, he busy. <laughs> That's my girl. She don't give a fuck. She's a nice girl, but um, she said, nah, mm, he busy. Because <laughs> this is what I'm thinking. She's thinking, which is true. Why am I going to piss on my motherfucking time with these people? Probably ain't going to get the car painted. And this is what I learned. The people that uh, want to, really want the car painted, they don't try to negotiate on price and all this other bullshit. They either take the price or not. 
These people want to negotiate already. The other one I was supposed to do that dude's girl's car. He want to negotiate. Man, fuck that negotiation. I want to get a sign that says, Carlos, motherfucker. Is that training you? Yeah, sure it's here. I'm having the gates locked. Anyway, come take forever to download this video. Am I in a good mood? Fuck yeah, I am. Some people's kids, anyway. Peace, people.